Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you like wigs, you've come to the right place because I have got a beauty for you today. So I will point out that I was approached by a company on Instagram that asked me if I would do a review on one of their wigs. They asked me to choose from their website which wig I would like to try. I let them know, but it's not gonna alter at all my review on the hair itself, the whole item, plus the website and how everything went in the process. So the company is called The Wig Hut and the brand of the wig is Sleek Hair Spotlight Luxury Wigs 100% Superior Synthetic Hair. This is the box that it came in. Um, it's got a little picture on the side here but it's not the colour that I've got. And um, yeah, it's in this box. It was a 48 hour tracked so it did not take long to come through at all i've opened up the lid and the, the hair lays inside like this it has got the netting on like that and it's got a cardboard ring going around it looks like we've got a little label thing here and that says code of care so care instructions applying your lace wig um, gives you full details there on what you can do it does have a thing at the bottom here that is for Twitter and for Facebook that is at Hair by Sleek if you want to go and have a little look at those. So taking the wig out of the box it was attached by these little tags here to the cardboard inside. There is the lacy net going over it and also some of the packaging inside the cap which is really good because if they don't have something in there then during like the delivery stage and when it's packed it can get quite flat here I will say pulling this out this cap feels amazing like I mean I love hair cube you know I love hair cube but they're quite hard on top and they can get sort of like deformed a little bit during the um, packaging stage but this is really light it's really soft and it's got a four inch hairline Right, I'm going to take those out and then we're going to have a little look. Okay, I've taken my um, jumper off because the cover of the wig and the cover jumper, you're going to want to see, you're going to want to see. Right, I just want to point out because I was taking the tag bits off and I just want to show you the amount of detail that they've gone into in caring for these wigs is that when they've put the tag thing that attached to the cardboard, they've put a tiny little bit of lace there to protect the cap of the wig. That is a lot of care and effort. So with that removed, we're going to go into the cap itself. It is, it is nice. It's a very nice quality. I will say that. We've got the four inch line lace at the top there. We've also got the breathable sides. This bit's netted, but we have got breathable sides. We've got a label at the back here that says sleek on it. And we've got these clip pin things that can attach to your cap underneath so you can just hook it, you can wear it with just your hair. I am going to be doing just my hair today so I'm going to be tying as much of my hair back as I can because I don't have a wig cap. It didn't come with a wig cap and the wig cap I have got I can't find it anywhere so we're just going to roll with it. So I've taken the little tag, oh it's a big tag, big tag off. This is a four inch deep lace parting plus baby hair lace parting wig. 100% Tongable fibre with realistic parting. It is in colour 1B, which is what I chose, and it's called the Atty Wig. There is various other colours which I'll put here. You can choose from other colours. A couple of them they don't have in stock at the moment. They've got the black, the 1B, the uh, purple, but the others are not in at the moment. Um, but there is also on here these attachments that you get. So I've put them on the setting that I know fits my head perfectly but you can adjust these to whatever you like. There's a lot of give there, but it's not like a weak one. So it feels quite sturdy. So that's all good. This is 30 inches in length. So it's a pretty long bouncy wig. Just look at that. And I will say also, because you need to see the part in, you need to see the top of the head. Oh my goodness me. Look at that. Can you, you just wouldn't, you just wouldn't, look at my hair, right, I washed it last night, I've got naturally curly hair and I've deliberately not 
straightened my hair because I want to blend my hair with this wig. But if you look, you would not look at that and go, that's a wig. That looks so natural. There is, I wouldn't put anything on that to hide any shine. Look at that. So I'm going to tie my hair back now and um, put this wig on. But I will say this is extremely light. It feels very light and airy like any human hair wigs that I've bought in the past, which I have bought. I used to buy these um, Zana wigs off Amazon. But the price of those have gone up so much that I haven't bought one recently. Now it says there's baby hairs. So we're just going to have a look at the front quickly. So that's what the front looks like. Very thin, very thin, which is good because on hair cube, I love hair cube, don't get me wrong. And I will continue to buy from them. But it's very big. It's almost like it's rolled like that. So the baby hairs, I can see a couple, but there's not really a lot going on. I will be honest. There's not a lot of baby hair, but you can create your own. It's not a problem. It's so easy to do. And this doesn't feel like really hard to trim synthetic. So when they say superior premium synthetic hair, I'm feeling it. I'm seeing it. And I'm loving it. So as I'm not using a wig cap, because I don't have one, I'm going to just get as much of my hair, leaving the edges like this. And I'm going to tie back as much as I can, as flat as I can on my head. But this wig feels so thin and flat on the top, but not in like a bad quality way, like in a really good way. But I'm not actually stressing about it bulking, so I've just done a tie up like that. I don't know if you can see. Um, and I'm going to do the same again at the back. And I'm just going to bunch it like that. I've left some of my natural hair out because I want to use that to really make this wig look as real as possible. Because we've got it going on with the lack of shine, with the feel of it, the texture, the lightweight, everything. So I feel that when I put this on, I'm going to be looking like one hot mama. So, here we go. I'm going to put it on. Okay. Oh. Woohoo! I haven't even got it on properly yet. So, where's the... I can't even find. I can't even find where they are. So, the clip is here. So, I'm just going to push that into where my hair's tied up, the straight bits. Now, this is my own hair coming through here. Which I'm just gonna put out of the way. And at the top here, where is it? I'm gonna try and line that into the center. I will show you what it looks like without pulling your own hair through because not everybody's got um, this color, naturally curly hair. And there's a clips in there. But so this is what it looks like with, I feel like, share this going on. So I would start and play around with it. Um, my curls aren't as tamed as this one. My curls kind of fly out all over different directions. But um, there you go, look. Look at that. So this is just the start of showing you. I've got plenty, plenty more. There's plenty more coming. But look, look. I mean, I mean, if I was outside and I just went like that, there ain't no one is ever gonna think Oh my god, look at that. They might think I've got like extensions going on because it's super long. It is unbelievably long and lightweight. There's no weight to it. It's like real hair. There is no weight to it at all. And it's got a it's got quite a nice smell. It hasn't got a nasty smell, it's got a nice smell. But this is beautiful. Look at that. Should we try a side part in? Let's get it, let's get let's get it over so having a look at this bit here when you flick it over it's not easy for me to see but you can't actually see any tracks like you can lift and lift and lift and you can't see any tracks this is 43 pounds 99 and i'm not joking i'll have it in every color every color but purple purple doesn't really that's my cat purple doesn't really do it for me but this oh oh <laughs> I'm in love. My cat wants to go out the back door one sec. I am going to take you outside in a minute so we can have a look, a little look and see what it looks like outside. But before I do that, do I have a spare? I do have a spare hair grip. So I've got a spare one here. Let's, let's put it up. 
and see how it looks. There's just so much hair. Like, I wouldn't want to brush it though, because I wouldn't want to ruin the curls. But I think putting it up is going to work really, really well because you can't see tracks at all. And it's so light on your head that you don't feel like it's going to fall back and come off your head. You've got those grips in there as well, which are holding it in place. I mean, Look. Just look at that. God damn it, look at that. The lighting in here is not that great. And, and I can't see when I bend down. But that's because we've got another gloomy day here in good old Brighty. But I'm going to show you what it looks like now without all of your hair coming out. I'm going to put all my hair underneath. And let's see what it looks like without my shenanigans coming out. God, I'm so in love. I can't believe this. I've never even heard of them. I've never heard of them. Like, I've never seen it come up on my search when I've searched wigs for sale in the UK. So this is what it would look like if you haven't got my hair coming through. Oh, yeah, that's all of my hair gone. That's what it would look like. It would look like that. And I think that's still pretty good. That is still pretty good. Play around with some baby hairs, but look at that. Is that my hair? Hang on. No, can't feel it coming off my head. That's what it would look like. I don't feel I've got the face structure for a look like that. I think I need a lot of baby hair coming out. Even if I was to do a flip over, because I've got quite a round top half and then I've got quite a thin, I have a very thin face. So I think if you've got a rounder face, it, it might look a bit better. But I think on me, it just doesn't go as well as having my own hair come through. And I think it doesn't look as natural, but that's because of, see that's a bit of my hair. There we go. But still, this looks Re really good for a wig that's not actually a lace front it's just a lace part in that still looks better than a lot of lace front wigs i've had in the past and i've had quite a few i've had charisma i've had lula bells i've had amazon type ones i've had zana i've had oh i've had all sorts i've had anyway i've had all sorts but yeah this is this is something else i'm telling you i'm telling you i'm telling you thank you so much thank you so much for sending me this wig because I will be buying from you. There is absolutely no, no choice about it. It might be after Christmas because I've got a quite a large family to buy for, but I'm definitely, I'm definitely, I'm coming up for that blonde one. I want the blonde one. <gasps> this is the length of it. It's pretty, um, pretty long. But it's beautiful, isn't it? Look. That's the curve of my back. That's where my bum starts. Oh, isn't it lovely? What do you think of it? What do you think of it? Let's go outside. It's a bit rainy. I'm going to pull all the hair forward. Just so while I chat to you about the website now, we can just look at this wig in all its absolute glory. And I will also say that there is no shedding. I've not seen a hair anywhere. But to be fair, I've not brushed it. I'm scared to brush it. I don't want to brush it. Because I like to lose this lovely little look that's going on. But going on to the um, website, there is a lot to choose from on there. Um, but I will say, and maybe it's in the process but i think the website needs a bit of work um if you go through you go on the website and you start clicking through various pictures of all the different wigs and i will say also that the wig looks so much better than it does on the website jesus if you want you can take a picture of me and have it on there instead anyway um it definitely is better than what it is on the website. When you click through continuously looking for a wig and say you're looking for this one and you're going through, through, through and you find it, you click on it and then you want to go back and continue to look through that selection, you have to start from the beginning again. It's 
really frustrating. There's no search for, like I wanted to search just this. Oh my God, my dog is heavy breathing. Chase, stop, Chase, Chase, no. If you, I wanted to search for this. So I wanted, I was looking for the search bar and there's no search bar. So yeah, I think everything is perfect. The wig is perfect. The packaging is perfect. The communication with them was perfect. Price wise, amazing, amazing. For a synthetic wig that feels this good, feels this light, has the details and the, the effort that's gone into this wig is amazing. So for £42.99, or is it £43.99, I can't remember which one it was. I'm all for it, I'm there. I will be, after Christmas, buying myself another one of these. I might even buy this one again because I love it so much, I'd like to have a backup. But um, yeah, there's nothing about this wig that irritates me. It doesn't feel heavy, it's not tight on my head, and I've been wearing this a little while now. Normally I'm like, I can start to feel a little bit of a pinch, but I can't live with it. But this one, not, it's not bringing that. So if you like this wig, check out the link down below. But I will say that the website is not that great. I'm being honest. Please don't feel offended. The wig heart, it, it needs work. It needs work. But this, this don't need work. This don't need work. Check me out. I'm going to be rocking into work like... Yeah, bitches. Does any remem anyone remember, like, if you're 80s, 90s, you'll know of this, okay? There was a doll, I think it was called the surprise, Hair Surprise or Surprise Hair Doll, that she would have, like, a plastic circle on the top of her head and a bit of hair, and she'd have short hair. But then you would do that, <laughs> and the hair would come out, like, you can, you can put it back in or you can come, come out. That's how I feel. I feel like I just go to bed at night with my short hair and I get up in the morning and I just start pumping my arm and then this hair comes out. Good hair. Yeah. Yes. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. And yeah, let me know what you think in the comments down below. And please believe when I say that if someone sends me something and I don't like it or they offer to send me something, I'm like, ah, oh, well, I'm not sure about that. I won't because I've, I've had so many offers in the past even hair cube have offered to send me stuff and the items that they've offered to send me I'm like no no sorry I will never share anything that I, that is really bad but I will never lie to you if I receive something that which I thought has potential but then when I get it it's like oh god I will always be honest with you and tell you and you'll know because you'll see me in my vlogs wearing this I'll be like ah hell yeah hell yeah Thank you for watching. I will see you all again in my next video. I hope you enjoyed these little wig selections I've got sending out to you. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching. All the links are down below. And go follow them on Instagram and and me. Jesus, Gabrielle Randono. Gabrielle XX Randono. Get on it. Bye.